bowl season, my favorite season and the fifth unofficial season of the year. Even with the opt-outs and everything that's happened this year with COVID, y'all can't tell me that you're not extremely excited to be completely hungover sitting on your couch January 1, feasting on nothing but food and football for 12 hours straight. And yeah, you can talk all the you want about how broken the college system is. And I agree, but I tip my cap to what they've created on New Year's Day. So the first game I wanna talk about on this glorious day is Northwestern laying the points against Auburn. And yes, I am an SEC girl through and through. I am unreasonably biased and I tend to think that the talent in the SEC is far above and beyond everywhere else. However, I don't let my bias get in the way of a good bet and I feel like this Northwestern team has been a great bet all year long. They play a bend but don't break defense that has given a lot of teams fits, including Ohio State. With this Auburn team, there's just so much uncertainty within the coaching staff. I mean, half of these guys know that they'll be looking for a job the following week. So next, we're talking Bama laying the points, and that's against Notre Dame. It feels dirty laying all of these points in a playoff game, especially against a Notre Dame team with only one loss, and Alabama didn't even cover against Florida last week. But alas, all of my research has this being an absolute Bama blowout. The Irish and Ian Book have looked great all year long, but that ACC game definitely exposed them. And I think that Nick Saban and that Alabama machine is going to take advantage of every single weakness. Not a single team has been able to stop this Alabama team, and I don't think Notre Dame will be the first. Give me Alabama, lay in the wood. Hopefully this next game will be a nightcap to our perfect day of football. And that's Ohio State and Clemson. I know Ohio State has only played six games, but it's tough to argue that these two teams aren't two of the best in college football. I could probably make the argument for Clemson to be a field goal favorite, but I just think Ohio State is catching way too many points in this spot. And look, this is somewhat of a revenge spot for Ohio State. I mean, there's some guys on that team that got beat by Clemson last year and want to right that wrong. Clemson did just look completely dominant over Notre Dame, but comparing Notre Dame to Ohio State is like comparing apples to oranges. I'm catching points with the Buckeyes and I like them. Let's go Ohio State. All right, y'all, that's all I got for this week. Hopefully this new year will bring you some new cash. Best of luck and let's make some money.